Hi everybody, welcome back to Daisy, and specifically welcome to the Daisy Launcher. And in this video, we're going to quickly look at how you can remove mods from um, your, your Daisy Launcher and kind of from your Daisy hard drive, um, and also how not to remove them from the hard drive, but perhaps just to remove them from the launcher list. So first off, let, let's look at the you know the most obvious one, which is let's say you're subscribed to a mod. In this case, uh, the Banoff Mad Mob. Banoff map mod and I don't want to be subscribed to it anymore um, maybe because I, I don't think I'm going to play it for a while could be I'm running a space on my hard drive something like that now to remove it, it's dead easy if you just go along to this little arrow here on the right hand side it will expand it and you'll get a, a little trash can sign so just click on that and say do you really want to unsubscribe from the mod and delete its files and you say yes and that will then go so that's very, very easy. Now, when you're messing around with DayZ, um, with things like um, local servers and uh, experimental servers, sometimes you'll suck mods in from <laughs> a different part of your hard drive, um, and they clutter up your um, they clutter up your launcher. And in this case, maybe you, you 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 don't want to delete from your hard drive, but you just don't want to have them in your launcher. And that's the case with these, where I think I was messing around with the experimental and I, I moved some, some mods in, but I just want to hide them. In that case, all you do is you click on there and you click on the delete and it will say, do you want to remove it from the list or remove and delete all the files? Well, because I'm not quite sure about where this mod is and what will happen if I delete it, I can just remove it from the list like that. Um, and then you can go through that and, and do that with uh, ones you're not quite sure about. So don't delete them. Um, from your hard drive, just delete them uh, from your list, and you can go through and you can do stuff like that. Uh, it's also worth noting that on your hard drive, if you go to where the um, Daisy mods are stored in the workshop folder, if you delete everything here, the next time you fire up the launcher, it will just download what you're subscribed to. Uh, if you're not sure where that folder is, if you just go to any uh, mod that's in the Steam Workshop, just open it up, click on the three lines there, and go open folder in Windows Explorer, and just just agree that you're not going to mess around with it. That's where they all are. So if you were to delete all these, the next time you open up the work, the uh, Daisy Launcher, it will download them all again. Um, so there we go. That is how you remove mods or delete mods from your daisy launcher and your hard drive and that's how you remove them from the launcher but don't delete them from your hard drive hopefully that's helpful if you've got any other questions about daisy remember to put them down below if you enjoyed the video hit like if you want to see more of the same press subscribe and i will of course see you again soon